welcome to the Great British Bake Off. The music, the tent, the bakers, this is all very familiar. And that's what brought me here to the Bake Off tent. The difference is, the bakers are singing. It was my great aunt Edna Suet, I was always forced to eat. The musical tells the stories of the bakers' lives, and it helped that the writers who met as students at university in Bristol were big fans of the show. We've been writing this for two years now, and so it means that whilst we were writing, there have been two new series come mm. on TV, and there were so many moments where we'd be watching the series and we'd ring each other being like, they've put in a bit that we've got in our show, and we're yeah. like, people are going to think that there we've were stolen some, it. There were some coincidences yeah. that we'd written you know, a certain sort of character and then an almost identical yeah. character came on TV and we were like, oh, we're all so aligned, it's still meant to be. Ciao. <laughs> a man of measurements, Russell's planning on using his trusty tools. All of the characters you'd expect to hear, but not quite as you know them. You look strangely familiar. Yeah, people say that. I don't know who, who no, they think who, we look who like. Who do they think we like? No, I'm, no playing a, I'm playing a blue-eyed, silver-haired baker called Phil Hollinghurst. Yes, and I'm playing a national treasure cook called Pam Lee. Yeah. Any resemblance to people living or dead is purely coincidental. Yes. There's a strange familiarity, it's on the tip of my tongue. Maybe we'll work that out later, yeah. As a vegan, I will not be cooking with butter. No, no butter. It's a musical I think that the world needs right now. You know, it's moving, it's very, very funny. And I think people, if they're in two minds at all about seeing this show, they should take the plunge and join us in the tent. From Cheltenham to Chichester, from Coventry to Kings. The music's absolutely beautiful. There's all sorts of different styles and it's very much an ensemble show, I think. It really is about the stories of the contestants and, and their journeys. There's lights and cameras everywhere and everyone gets a sick. I can't believe they chose me. Expect cakes, slapping of dough, baking disasters, plenty of laughs, but also a musical with real heart and emotion. My legs are like spaghetti. Obviously musicals are often about expressing what you can't necessarily say in dialogue but you know sing what's in your head so you're 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 giving permission to f go deeper into those characters which sometimes might involve yeah going a little deeper into their backstory and what's happened in the past and what they might be baking for now which obviously you do get on bake off the program but maybe not to quite the same extent that we're able to do in a musical but only the very best baked their way to this year's legendary gingham altar please tell me there's plenty of bake off in your windows in this show You'll have to wait and see. <laughs> no one's giving the game away. No. No. No, we're not. no, you've got to come and see it. Yeah. I mean, it's everything you want in this show and more. And let's keep 24. The show has been five years in the making and was the brainchild of the Everyman's chief executive. Someone who worked in my advertising and marketing company, knew someone who was a runner on the Bake Off show, and they said to me that there was a joke going around the Bake Off studio that they might like to make Bake Off into a musical. And so I immediately got in touch with Richard Macro, who is head of Love Productions, who created the show. We had a conversation and he gave me permission to start developing Bake Off the Musical. And it's taken five years, but not only is it now here, it's wonderful that five years ago I was not the chief executive of the Everyman Theatre in Cheltenham. So to be opening it now in my own theatre in Cheltenham is fantastic. Oh, so can the cast rise to the technical challenge of pulling off a signature show at the Gingham Altar? Find out when Great British Bake Off the musical opens on Saturday. Steve Nibbs, BBC Points West, at the Everyman Theatre in Cheltenham.